everybody we are back with another disney dining review and you'll never guess where we are we are you might guess yeah maybe we're at disney's animal kingdom lodge and tonight we are having dinner at boma yay we're having dinner at boma of course boma is a buffet style uh breakfast lunch and dinner and we're here for dinner so we're gonna go in we're gonna have some fun we're gonna get some food we're gonna show you around maybe there'll be some animals out that we can give in put it into the b-roll but uh we've been here before but we've never actually filmed it so tonight we're gonna film it right I love boma well just gave it away <laughs> anyway we'll see if we love boma come on let's head inside All right, so we are done with dinner here at Boma, and what do you think? I love Boma. <laughs> <laughs> She's surprised. I wonder if we said that in the beginning of the video. I no, still love Boma. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was awesome. The one thing that Boma does not lack is variety. It really, as a buffet, which is what it is, and it's what, 60 bucks a person? It's like $59.99. It's not cheap, but it doesn't lack variety. You've got plenty to choose from. Whether it's their meats, whether it's their rice, whether it's their soups, whether it's their desserts, you name it, they have something really for everybody, including a kid's area as well. Um, just some an African inspired dishes, so you're gonna get some variety for those with broader taste buds. And then some more basic things or things that you can try if you're not as um, adventurous. Like and me. That's what I like. It's something we can both enjoy. And right now, I'm trying really hard to stay away from certain things like sugars and a lot of carbs that aren't whole grains. So they have a lot of options too that are healthier for you. You know, a lot of you know proteins and salads, um, great things that you can eat of a more healthy variety too, which I very much enjoy. And yeah. came out of there feeling full and just feel really good. And yeah, yeah. It, it's really good food all around. The aesthetic, of course, of the entire restaurant is great. It wasn't too loud in there. We were with friends. We were able to have nice conversations without having to talk really, really loud. Our waiter was phenomenal. Kept our drinks filled the entire time. Didn't Very nice. Ever ask. Never funny. asked. Never overstep. Was never too much. It was just perfect. You know, very. Mm -hmm. Very good, very yeah. good atmosphere and experience. So I've always had good experiences here. Exactly. It's not cheap, but I think it's it's worth it. It's a good experience. It's a good meal. The animals are right outside too, which you can experience them. It's gonna be a little difficult at night to see them, but if you're here during the day, you might be able to see them 
Uh, we enjoy Boma. We definitely would say it, it's a it's a must do. We think you guys will enjoy it. We enjoyed it. The kids that are walking by enjoyed it as well. <laughs> But I think the meats overall are, are quite tender, seasoned well. They have some things of a, maybe a little bit of a spicy variety. Some have more of an African flair spice. But everything was very well cooked and seasoned. And um, I'm a sucker for my, my treat tonight was the chicken corn chowder, which she I got like absolutely two bowls of that. love here. So I probably shouldn't have eaten a lot of that, but that was yeah, my I got special a, treat today. Yeah, I got a, <laughs> I got some chicken. I got some some. Um, I got meatballs, I got macaroni and cheese, I got my normal stuff, I got ribs, I've got um, just, it was really good everything I got. I got some of the seafood gumbo, mm -hmm. which I tried, which was really tasty. I Paul enjoyed it. I even tried the oxtail stew. He didn't know he was trying the oxtail stew. He dished it up while I was standing right there and I said, I'm not saying a word. Because I knew if he read it, he'd be like, I'm not eating that. Yep. And he actually didn't mind it. No, so I didn't mind it. That good flavor. Good flavor. So see... Walt's getting getting to be a big boy. He's trying all the, getting the to be new a big stuff. Boy. He's getting more adventurous without even knowing it. So if I told him that's oxtail stew, he wouldn't have eaten a bite. Nope. <laughs> anyway, there you go, guys. That's our review of Boma. Definitely a must-do. We give it a thumbs up. We think you guys will enjoy it. It's not cheap, but we think it's we think it's probably worth it for yeah, sure. We love it's Boma. A nice place to come. Probably not every every week, but it's some place we very much enjoy, it. and I think you will too. Yep. So dinner for sure, breakfast for sure as well. And I forgot they have breads, they have um, hummus, they have, um, of course, the zebra domes they're very famous for for their desserts and some other desserts which I didn't even look at because I knew it would be very difficult. But that's something that you want to try too um, if you haven't eaten a before. Yep. So there you go, guys. It's a thumbs up from us. We really hope you guys enjoyed the video. We enjoyed bringing it to you. And until next time, as the bus pulls away, each other. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. Bye, everybody. Bye.